Now here's a piece. It's worn. It's old. You see, you never could cut yourself on that. But it's not old enough for me. It hasn't got the salt. It hasn't got, it's too smooth. It's got, still got shine. This is June Thompson, the town clerk of the town of Tremont. And when she wants to relax, she just walks the beach looking for the jewels of the beach sea glass. Our guest today on People, Places, and Things. It's a chance to pick up a jewel. It's a chance to uh, do something while you're walking. It's a chance to arrange them, to make something from them if you want to, or just to relax you or when you get home. You come home, it's see what I've got. All right, what makes a good piece of sea glass? Age and the salt and the grinding of the sand against it and the color. Blue is quite rare, but blue, it takes longer to age than the others. But to me, the most valuable piece is the lavender or the purple or orchid or whatever. I don't think purple whiskey bottles were popular or when they were used as uh, toggles, which is what all this stuff is. This is the bottom of a toggle that they attach to a trap. Just a moment ago, you threw a piece back. You said it hadn't been in the water long enough. Right. How about the piece you have? Well, this I found down at Bass Harbor, down beyond my mother's place. And it wasn't, didn't have enough of the white. It looked almost smooth in one place. So I looked at it and I said, that's not old enough. And it hasn't got enough salt and it hasn't got enough wear. So I threw it back in the ocean. And I waited two years. And then I brought it. I went down and I kept thinking, I'll see it somewhere near where I threw it. But with the tides coming and the tides going, one day I found it quite by surprise, way up, not anywhere near where I'd thrown it. And I, re I recognized it because there was that little nick. And I brought it in, and I said, it's time I took it home. So it came home with me. June Thompson has been the town clerk of Tremont for about, well, it's been 15 years. Sees maybe on the average of, what, 300 people a month. Since 69, she's performed over 200 marriages, and so no wonder she goes beachcombing, as it were. And what do you do whether you bring that glass home? Well, you fill one jar, you fill another, and another, and another, and pretty soon, how many have you got? Forty or so, and the jardinier runneth over. In Tremont, Cliff Reynolds, on people, places, and things.